Welcome back, boys and girls. We're here for our second film from Group Two, and I'm sorry, what's your name? Jason Bachigalupi. God bless you. <laughs> it's Bachigalupi. What, is, what does that mean? Is that Italian? Yes, it's Northern it? Italian. It's like Bachigalupi. Yeah. Okay. All right, so let's take a, what's the name of the film? Zyvon's Gambit. Zyvon's Gambit, okay. So let's, let's let it roll. Aren't you supposed to be in my class in five minutes? I know, but I have something to do first. Well, you have five minutes. Hey, Olga, what's up? Are you okay? Hey, what's that, Olga? Yeah, I walked like her. She looks weird. Hey, Olga, English lists the other way. How rude. You there? You there? I see you have arrived. Who are you? My name is Zyvin, and I need your help. I've had a horrible vision, and I don't want it to come true. What's with the costume? I am a mighty wizard. Here. Examine it. Ha ha! I win again! Uh, Up there, you uh, always win! <laughs> what the? Keep looking. Whoa. 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 Hey, who invited Gandalf? <laughs> <laughs> Silence! I am a mighty wizard, and this will prove it to you. Whoa. 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 Hey, bro, Whoa. stop messing with our game! Just open the box. Whoa, what is this? This gives me more powers. Whoa! Whoa. Watch. As you can see, I have a royal flush. You can't beat it. Whoa! Go ahead. Answer. Okay. Hello? I'm um, who? Simon? Oh, you mean that crazy wizard dude with the wizard robe. Um, hey, I'm Simon. <laughs> it's for you. Hello? I've been exiled in this microscope slide for 10 years, but now I'm out. And I shall get my revenge for what you have done to my face in trapping me in this microscopic prison. I will be with you shortly and be prepared because I've gotten stronger since the last time I met you. I'm just as strong as I was 10 years ago. Sure you are. Who was it? Who was it? <sighs> Guys, I need your help. With what? what? There is a psychopath necromancer going to destroy the world as we know it. He will turn every living thing into figurines to do his bidding. Like this. Holy lonely pony eating macaroni! Well, what's in this for us? I mean, peace and safety is nice and all, but if we're putting our necks on the line, I feel like we should get something in return. 
or give you magic powers. Yeah. All right. Sounds that's, that's cool. Sure. Okay. You with the tattoos can control elemental powers with your arms. Whoa! Whoa! You with the chest hair have chest hair stronger than any armor. Whoa! You three with the lanterns can stun any evil for a 100 years. They can also save your lives when you truly need it. Okay, Neil should be here at any moment. It is I, Neil the Necromancer. I am here for my revenge. Guys, stand back. Dang, this is some nice chest hair. How's this gonna protect this? It's just, it's just a table. Your lanterns will put a force field around the table, making it almost as strong as Terry's chest hair. But I think it'll only take a couple more hits. It, it, it's kind of cramped back here. Hey, hey, Terry, you have armor. You can stand out there and, and, and you're fine. And it'll probably be a good distraction. Oh, okay. Ah, ha, hey, Voldemort's over here. Ah. Johnny, use your arms. Here we go. It's not over. I'll make you pay. Guys, it's time to take him down. Neil, I'll give you five seconds. Or I'll be forced to use these lanterns' ultimate power. Never! Three, two, one. Neil, you have caused nothing but pain, death, and suffering. And with this next spell, I shall make sure that you never wreak havoc ever again. Do we get to keep the superpowers? Of course. Oh. Oh. I see you're still here. You must take this and put it in a place where no one will ever find it. Will I ever see you again? Let's hope you don't have to. I know just the place for you. Hey, can we play poker at your house next time? How did you do that? The magic of special effects. All right, I'm telling you. Okay, so I have a couple of questions here. Who is uh, Zion? Zyven. <laughs> Zyven. What, what, who is he? And what on earth is a, a, a gambit? Uh, Zyven is a magic. It was a magical wizard that travels through the different dimensions fighting evil. Okay. Was there <laughs> any romance on the set that, you know, you can tell me if it was a. No? No, no we were very professional. Very professional? Yeah. Okay. Good. Okay. How did you get here today? What, what was your mode of transportation? I was actually driven, driven by the parents of one of my campmates. Okay, because th this isn't going as good as I thought it was going to go. Could, can I ask you to leave? I'm out of here. <laughs> well, I mean, don't, don't be like that. Come on. I'm, I'm just saying if you want me to leave, we'll go. I would. Okay. Just, do you know where the door is over there? Yeah. Yeah, I Okay. See. Over there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Over okay. there. No, there. That oh, door. Oh, yeah, that door. You can be a little more specific next time. I'm not good with the door. Things. The door. And don't be hanging around out there. I won't. And now I'd like to introduce you to our amazing neighbor that specializes in animation, Danny Bowman. Oh, I thank you so much for inviting me there, Judge Volta. Oh, it's my pleasure. Okay. <laughs> it's wonderful. So tell me, how do you work as an animator? What inspires you? 
it started out like this. I remember um, when I was younger, I just used to obsess with cartoons and be raised into a different animation worlds. Mm -hmm. And as over the years, I through, throughout my elementary school, I used to draw all these books based on what I really love and stuff. Used to do every all kinds of activities, and then I discovered my talent at age of, at age 11. I used to do a lot of um, lots of picture books inspired by many um, chapter books that has pictures on it and stuff. And I uh, something that the audience doesn't know out here is uh, we didn't we do a book together. Of course we did a book together. We did Danny and Goliath. Remember yeah. that? Well, I'm not that old. I do remember that. <laughs> I'm the one that brought it up. You did. Okay, can you show us some of the work that the kids did? Sure, no problem. The, it's, you're going to like it. It's so wonderful. <laughs> okay, let's roll it. Okay. There's another tool I'm going to show you. It's called the paint bucket tool, which means I can color anything I want. I can just change the color and change the color schemes around. Like this end. 